JFAM, JFAM, this is the covenant of love, the covenant of Yisrael, Yisrael, with Yahuwah, Eluahim. Read it, and if you are not in that covenant, then you are cursed and on your way to the pit in judgment. Shalom, Shabbat Shalom to my people. I hope that you will take this message seriously, and I pray that <clears throat> understanding would be given to you on this day for... The scripture we're about to talk about why everyone's cursed unless they're an Israelite an eternal immortal Israelite it's because they have rejected the Torah of Yahuwah Sabbath of the armies of Israel and despised the word of the set apart one of Yisrael which we know as Messiah Yahusha so not only have they done the the, the most abominable things by starting their own religions and, and, and making up gods and all kinds of stuff when we know there's only one God and that one true God is Yahuwah Eluahim so two things you gotta do to come back into um, Yisrael, Israel and be immortal you have to accept the Ten Commandments the Torah of love and you have to accept the blood sacrifice of Messiah Yahusha that was given at the stake for you to come back into Yisrael and you can do this if you follow or subscribe my page the pledge to become an israelite is on that page and you can do that now you can take the oath and you can be immersed in living waters and at that point you will get much further than most anybody has and you will receive the ruah hakadesh which is the set apart spirit of yahuwah you will receive your ruah like gifts which are spiritual gifts and you will actually be able to do supernatural power in the name of Yahusha. So, this is why everyone is cursed. And if you really want to come into the immortal eternal life with the one true God, this is the way back in. You have to come back into the love covenant, the Ten Commandments. Pledge yourself to them in Yahuwah. And then you have to ask him to do it through the blood of Messiah Yahusha. And then, boom, you're an Israelite. Be immersed and come into the power and start renewing the time, renewing the people. We're supposed to be renewing everything before judgment falls upon us all. And it won't fall upon me because I'm redeemed. But on everyone, judgment shall fall because this is the distress that we are in now. And bad things are happening and getting ready to get worse. And then the judgment. Yay! And in that time frame, our Messiah will return and he will establish his kingdom on earth forever which is the israelite kingdom the yishraelite kingdom because yishrael is the only immortal eternal people if you are yishrael that means you are a child of yahuwah Eluahim. shabbat shalom my brothers and sisters if you are be immersed and start doing your supernatural work in the yahusha in yahusha's name because we must be focused on the besorah the message of yahusha and gathering the lost and preparing in these last days in these times of distress for the worst time to come which is the judgment which is upon us shabbat shalom yisrael and to you gentiles repent 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 right away and do it before you pass away because the pit is waiting for you and so is judgment all right hallelujah huwa aluahim hallelujah husha aluahim and may the Ruh HaKadesh be with you all. Baruka Haba Bayahuah.